Hey guys, I don't know when this video is going up. I have a lot to like pre-film. I'm cooking dinner tonight. My sister, her boyfriend's coming over and I'm making a recipe I saw on Instagram reels. I feel like I've been in such a habit of cooking the same things. I'm excited to try something else. Look how beautiful this goop shade is. I get so sidetracked. I'm in pajamas and it's not even five o'clock. When you're watching this, I don't know when this is going up, but I just got home from Italy like a day or two ago. So I'm pretty jet lagged still. So I need to unpack stuff and then I have a bunch of PR from being away and I thought I'd show you guys some of it. And then I also have a bunch of big boxes and I'm going to do a giveaway soon. I've been compiling stuff. Sweatsuit pajama set is daily drills. And then they also sent me this sweater that I actually filmed in this morning for a makeup video with Milk Makeup. Really adorable. Um, so this jumpsuit is it's like a little short jumpsuit situation and then it has a big open back. I'm actually gonna put this aside because I'll do a try on of everything at some point so I can lay it over what I'm talking about. This top, pretty sure this is a skirt. This beautiful long sleeve top. I need to iron all this stuff. I thought this dress was really cute. My camera and film because I'm currently on the way to a nail appointment in case you need some fall nail inspiration. These are my real nails and they have grown very long so I think I might go with this. Thank you. What's the one that just makes it shiny? Classic? is what they look like. 
They look really nice. I like how you just see the sparkle in the light and then in the shade they kind of just look... Actually, you can kind of see it. Good morning, guys. Having some coffee outside. It's a really still morning, so I figured I'd just come outside and have my coffee. I have a couple meetings this morning, so one for my makeup line that I'm working on, and then I also have therapy. And then I also want to go to Target and like a home decor store today. I need to get pillows for my couch. My dogs are being very needy. <laughs> and then also I kind of want to do some like Halloween decorations around the house, or at least at the front of the house. Oh, I need to get other simple little things while I'm out, like Tupperware. That's kind of a boring one. Um, a towel for the dog's bowl. Little things. I also feel like it's a perfect time to introduce BetterHelp to this video. So thank you so much to BetterHelp for sponsoring today's video. It's very fitting because I have therapy this morning. If you guys don't know what BetterHelp is, it's basically an online site that connects you with a certified therapist. And the reason I love it so much is you can do it from the comfort of your own home. So you can do your therapy via messaging, you can do it through video chat, you can do it through phone call. If you don't really mesh with the therapist that they've given you, you're not locked in or committed. You can always change and try somebody else. What motivated me to try therapy was just hearing such a positive response. So many people around me uh, had so many great things to say and people I really trusted and I knew that really cared for me and loved me and said I think you would benefit from this so I think like the biggest positive change I've taken away from therapy is just I handle situations with a lot more awareness. BetterHelp is on a mission to make starting therapy easier. I thought this was quite cool too. There's a journal inside the platform for self-reflection. And there are also like group sessions on a number of different topics every single day, which is also kind of fun. So basically you just fill out a questionnaire and then they'll match you with somebody. If you do want to try BetterHelp, you can use my link. I'll put it on the screen, but I think it's just betterhelp.com slash Olivia Jade and it will get you 10% off your first month of therapy. Okay, I'm jumping on my meetings. I'll see you guys soon. Hi. All right, I just got dressed for the day. It's hot. Wearing just a little simple sundress. I did really light makeup. I tried this new Say Slip Tint Concealer. I think it's so good. It's everything you want in a product, so... That's kind of my new go-to concealer. And then also the, I believe the brand is called One. One Beauty? No. It's Patrick Starr's brand. What is it called? One Size. One Size. The One Size Pink Powder is perfect. I'm gonna try and make this quick. guys I'm sitting at my desk right now trying to plan a trillion different videos before I leave so a lot of the travels I'm doing I'm gonna be filming but then there's one trip I'll just go and be present and enjoy myself so there's so much I need to like prep prior to leaving and I'm slightly stressed <laughs> but it's okay I have a meeting tonight with my manufacturers another meeting with them for the makeup product, I just approved all the samples, so we're kind of getting into next steps. Right now I'm going to work out. I've been doing Form, which is Sammy Clark's app. I love her. And then tonight I'm going to an event with one of my girlfriends. It's for DVF. My weight's on. I put a mirror here, I feel like this will be a lot better for filming. I'm running out the door really quick because I want to... <clears throat> Hello. I'm redoing my bedroom right now. I'm being my own interior designer. So I ordered a new bed, a new dresser, both from Shop Amber, but they have a store in the Palisades in LA. So I'm gonna go and see. I just wanna see if they have any pillows I wanna get or little things to put around the house. I also need new lamps, like bedside table lamps. 
So I'm just gonna go have a look. I didn't really have any luck. This tool saves lives. <laughs> I'll put a link to it below. It's a heated round brush. You don't have to know how to do your hair. I have a meeting in 30 minutes, but then I have an event with a girlfriend. So I'm gonna just do my hair now. I already styled it this morning with this heated round brush. Just gonna split it into three parts. This is a very much trust the process. I had no luck at Amber Interiors today. I just have to jump on this meeting for my makeup company and then I'll probably get ready and do like a full face makeup. I have some really light makeup on from earlier today. I will revamp it before I go out. I'm gonna feed my dogs before I get on this call. I'm just back downstairs in the office. this event that one of my best friends was going to and she was like will you come and then I realized that the brand had messaged me about it so then I just said I'd go so here we are I don't really normally go to events I think we're just gonna stop in I have a ring light so I can see but it's gonna make my face look so oily so just bear with me guys okay, so skin prep first like a really thick layer. Okay, first things first. I'm gonna start with my eyebrows. A little micellar water. Go through them to get any excess primer or moisturizer. Makeup artist taught me this when I was in Venice. All those little creams can build up in the eyebrow and then they're not gonna hold the product as well like any gel and remove them. I'm gonna brush them all this way and down. So we're gonna make it look like I'm barely wearing makeup but there are so many steps into barely wearing makeup. A little bit of Anastasia Brow Freeze, but I'm kind of wiping off all the gel. It's just a very, very light amount. I'm starting with a very light layer of foundation. I don't normally wear foundation, but a makeup artist did this on me recently and I loved how it looked. So I just need to find the right shade. I'm gonna take a little bit of this Mario bronzer and mix it with a little foundation. And I'm just doing a very light layer. Remember, you can always add more. Just washed all my makeup brushes. This is your sign to do that if you've been putting it off for a year as well. <laughs> just gonna use this Mario brush and kind of take up that excess light layer. Even if it matches really well, just blend down your neck to be safe whatever's left on this brush and kind of use it on the lid. Using Laura Mercier Caviar Stick and Brick. Blending. Edges. With like a real brown, I'm just gonna go up in here. And then with a little bit of this shadow stick in Dune, take a clean brush. Bronzer. A little bit of this bronzing gel. I'm gonna do my bronzer on top of this as well, but this is just like a little base. more bronzer. I have no idea what I'm gonna wear. We're just blending this out. Now to conceal. I feel like the trick with concealer is to keep building it. You don't want to put on everything at once. So you can go here. A mix between fluffy and dense. Okay, 
I'm gonna add some blush. Kind of wanted to do like a light pink, but this will do. Great. Now, if you want to add more concealer, this is where I would say it's your time to shine. Put out my hand first, and then I'm just gonna blend it under my eye. Great. I'm gonna use this one size pink setting powder. I'm gonna take a little puff. Just press it right under. I love having glow, obviously, but especially if I'm going somewhere, there might be any sort of photography. I just like to blur. I'm gonna use a little bit of this brow whiz. Gonna use a little bit of brown mascara. Remains very natural. Perfect. Oh, I'll do my lips. We're done. Hope you guys follow it if you have an event or dinner or something to go to. I feel like I kind of crushed that. It's pretty casual. And then this bag is quite cool. Just waiting for my girlfriend to pick me up. I don't have room for my giant camera, but I'll bring my phone and film a little bit of the evening. Give a little wave. <laughs>